Hello there everybody, this is Gmodon and welcome to SCP-087 Recovered Document. Uh, I was gifted this game from a wonderful, super wonderful person on Steam, uh, their name is Neon Particle. Uh, apparently this game is in uh, Greenlight or Beta or something uh, and it looks really interesting so far. Uh, as uh, I'm sure many of you know, SCP-087 is the like the never-ending staircase. Uh, and I did I did a little bit of testing with this with a free run so I can try and get my recording quality to not be as shit as it was in the last time I did a recording. Sorry about that. Um, and the sensitivity is crazy and there are not many options in this game, unfortunately. The About has a bunch of Russian, which obviously I do not speak or read Russian or understand it. So I'm going to go ahead and jump into the history here with D8432. I guess this has like a story of one of the uh, the D class that went into the um, the SCP-087. What we walk for? For the peace in the world? For saving people? No. We are like butchers who don't have mercy on anyone. Our lives are like chips on the playing board. Firstly we gain them, and then we go all in, losing everything. I am too deep in my mind. There is no elevated proof to change the situation. The end is near, but there is something lingering in my mind. I'd better get deep down, and turn out in the moment when I met the little guy for the first time. The investigation has been approved by the people having fourth level of admission. Thanks. Starting immediately. Best of all, to start with the recording of our first discovery in the object SCP-087. Okay, I will say the the cinematography itself and uh, like how well that was recorded and edited, that was really good. Criticism, kind of necessary. The voice acting could use work, but like... Everything else is pretty good so far of what I've seen of this game. Um, it's fucking dark. Is your flat line functioning properly? Yeah, it's working. <laughs> you just won't slide these stairs all the way down. <clears throat> Thank you. Please continue. It's fucking dark. <laughs> it's fucking dark, mate. It's fucking dark. Uh, now, the thing I'm not a fan of, oh, what was that? Oh, that's me! Oh, that's me! That's me. Uh, the thing I'm not a fan of is, um, this mouse sensitivity that I wish I could change, but if I press escape to try to bring up the options, uh, it just knocks me right out of the game, but just like, look, I'm barely moving my mouse, and it's going insane. So I don't know if this is randomly generated or if there is more, um, you know, more of an actual story, I guess, if I'm more railroaded than the uh, other SCP-087 games, because those are generally tend to be railroad, not railroaded, um, you know, randomly generated where... Oh, he might be on this floor, or he might be on this floor. Uh, da, 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 da. So, um, I guess we're gonna find out on that. Find out next time on Dragon Ball Z. Uh, oh. You hear that? There is a fucking kid down there. Sounds like one. Could you please describe the sound? It's young. Either female or a very young boy. It's crying. Can you estimate distance from your current location? Oof, fuck, I don't know. Maybe 200 meters down. 
Please continue down the next flight. That's pretty specific. <laughs> also, I love he's like, man, there's a kid down there. He sounds young. <laughs> I would I would imagine so if it was a kid. Uh, I do like the added, you know, layer of you feel like you're an actual person playing through this and going yes, down. Yes. We are picking it up as well. Please continue down. Stop if you notice any change in the audio or environment. Or the blah, 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 blah. I didn't. I did not understand what he just said. I will say this game is doing a really good job on the atmosphere. Like I'm actually oh five. Oh fuck me, dude! I'm a little spooked right now. <laughs> oh no, I'm a little spooked. I don't like this. I don't like this. From a sound design perspective and like how slow they make you walk. Oh god. What was that? I don't want to do this anymore. Why is this my line of profession? I didn't sign up for this. I don't enjoy this. I'm not a fan of this. Uh, no thanks. We're gonna sing a happy song. We're gonna sing a happy song. Happy, 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 happy. I'll be honest. I've just, I, I just want to close my eyes right now. So I'm gonna do that for like a good five seconds. All right. Tell me if you guys see anything, because <laughs> I don't want to see anything. Uh. Oh. Yeah. No. I'll pass on that. Thanks. Thanks. I will pass on that. Is that like a, hey, you should look behind you thing? Because, yeah, no, not happening, my good friend. Somebody come get this child or call DHS. One or the other. Oh, oh, there's the sounds. Oh. Good. Good. Oh, no, 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 no. Not you again. Get out of here. I've been working on the railroad. Is this is, is a Oh god. Please. <laughs> Keep going, please. His uh, his feet are kind of like a rhythm. I've been working on the railroad all the live long day. <sighs> I've been working on the rail road just to slave the day away. I don't know if that's lyrics. Oh god, I'm too scared right now. I think the worst part about these sort of games that are very simplistic in nature is just the sound design, the emptiness, how alone you feel the repetitiveness of it and i think that's that's also you know what made pt which was the playable trailer the silent hills uh trailer the it's what made it so you know well done and so well received because this is the thing about horror less is more and it's games like this that really get that it's simple, yet it does a hell of a job. Oh boy, this is going on for quite a while. Ugh, I don't know how much more of this I can take. Oh god, I'm like hiding behind my microphone at this point. You guys ready for a little ASMR? <laughs> I can't tell you how many people have like requested me to do ASMR stuff. I'm getting any uh. closer to the kid. Noted. Please continue. Noted. Please continue. Lovely. So there is. It feels like there is like maybe story progression. I don't fucking know. <sighs> oh yeah, ASMR shit. Um, I've gotten requests to do that kind of stuff, and like, if you if you dig it. You dig it. Hey, that's for you. Hey, shadowy man. Uh, if that's for you, you dig it. You dig it. Um, 
I just, I'm, mm, I don't know how to feel about it. It's just a thing for me. And sorry to let you guys down that have requested it. Oh, hi. That have requested it, but you know, it's not really my thing. This is about as close as you will get to experiencing ASMR with Chimodon. <laughs> I don't even know if you can hear me past the, the clonk, clonk. Oh, hello, Shadow Man. You know, I like this, this SCP, it's, it's a pretty, you know, it's a cool SCP, whatever. Uh, oh God, he scared me again. Shadow Man. Uh, it's a cool SCP and all, but I don't, I don't understand why it's such a, you know, popular subject for making games out of it. Um, there goes the, the Shadow Man again, that crazy, crazy Shadow Man. Um. I don't like I guess because it's a very simple game to make and back to the whole you know horror and simplicity and shit like that but I, I don't know I feel like we're we're rehashing things a little bit and I don't know can somebody please get that child a binky oh shadow man Stay well. It's natural. Please continue. <sighs> what the fuck is that? Shit! Holy fucking shit! What the fuck? Can you please describe what you see? Uh oh. It's some sort of fucking person face thing. And it's fucking looking right at me. Uh oh. Fuck. Fuck, it's looking right at me. Is it moving? No. It just started at me. Fuck. Fuck, it's creepy. Please approach and further eliminate the entity. Holy shit! Wait, that's it? I... I... I didn't... His behavior is in no way different from that of a normal person. <laughs> At the beginning of our joint studies of SCP-087, he behaved adequately. The delinquency started to emerge much later. Yet again, the cinematography is pretty great. Did you just print those papers out where they were already like highlighted? <laughs> Did you highlight that in Google Docs? Seems like a highlighting is like an after the fact sort of thing you do, but you know. Oh, I'm not one to judge. The tension. Okay, I'm waiting. I have an idea of what could happen to him. But it's not really probable as no one breaks the rule of housing. It's dangerous not only for one person, but for all people surrounding him. Well, while I'm waiting, I'd better study the notes of our research. Because all my groundless suppositions still remain suppositions. Was that it? Are there others? Nope. That was it. <laughs> I guess that was SCP-087 recovered document. Um... I'll, I'll be honest, a lot of the stuff this guy said I could not understand very well because his accent was very thick and heavy. And that's not me, you know, dissing this guy at all. Like, I can only speak one language. <laughs> I, I gotta give him props for being able to speak, you know, more than one language. That's really, really amazing. But uh, going forward, I believe this game would benefit a lot from other voice actors that 
are, you know, their native language is English or they have, you know, a more pronounced uh, accent. But other than that, um, very interesting game. Uh, I, I am a little disappointed that the end just kind of, it just kind of came without really any payoff, honestly. Uh, the free run is just, you can, you know, go through the game again. You can just, you can just go. Just go and go and go. And I'm sure you can go for, like, you know, infinite. I don't know if it's randomly generated or not. But that this is pretty much uh, the entire game. Definitely a very cool idea. Kind of reimagining SCP-087 as, like, this... Uh, researcher who's going through the case files and documentations etc etc i think it's very cool and you guys should go support him on steam uh i like i said i think this is greenlit or you know in beta testing or something i don't know i don't know the jargon i'm sorry but yeah go check it out and thank you again so much neon particle for gifting this game to me that was super duper awesome of you and i appreciate it a bunch. So thank you guys for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye!